guys remember these 3D Doritos? I think they used to come in like a canister in the nacho cheese flavor, but now they have them in crunchy ranch or crunch spicy ranch. It looks so good I couldn't help myself. I will say it's not as light and crunchy as like the old ones. I think the older ones were a little bit thinner, kind of had more of like a crisp to it, but this one's more like a chip that's kind of puffed up. Still really good, but not as good as like the old school 3D Doritos. Oh wow, that's a really good flavor actually. It has like a nice kick to it. The flavor is like spot on. I give this flavor maybe like a nine out of 10 and texture, I would give it maybe like a five out of 10. I think the old ones are way better. Okay, so I feel like my grading wasn't that fair. I think the first two bites were just a little bit inconsistent and they were just a little bit thicker. Now I've had like three or four bites and I would now give the texture a seven out of 10. Flavor is still nine out of 10, but yeah, not five out of 10 for the texture, it's seven out of 10. I'm just going to be doing a few errands around the house. Well, not errands, but like chores around the house, like doing laundry, cleaning. Um, yeah, it's basically Saturdays are my cleaning day. So that's what I'll be doing. I'm just going to put on very, very light makeup. I already have my skincare on. Um, I'm just gonna go in with my CC cream. I'm really excited because I ordered the M Cosmetics uh, Daydream Cushion. It's like Michelle Phan's um, makeup line and she has like a new cushion foundation. Although I've heard it's more like a um, tinted moisturizer, but I'm really excited to try it because I'm about to run out of my favorite CC cream. So I thought I'd try it out the, the cushion um, only because I feel like it's easier to use and like your hands don't get as dirty. I also ordered Glossier's um, Cloud Paint. I've tried it one time at my friend's house and I absolutely loved it. Um, I ended up getting the shade Dusk and so I'll be sharing that with you guys once I receive the packages, um, hopefully next week. So I am currently in the process of trying to change my eating habits and go back to how I used to eat before I got married. Ever since I've been married, I've been just a lot more comfortable eating like chips at night, having more soda, even having like candy and chocolate in the evenings. Trust me, I'm not one to ever eat like candy or like snack on chips late at night. I'm usually all about like having a piece of fruit and some nuts or like a piece of beef jerky um, and maybe just some like healthy crackers or like I'll do like cheese and salami. Um, but I've been pretty free. I've definitely felt a little bit of weight gain lately. Um, not like a whole ton. Um, but more than like the number of pounds I'm gaining, I'm just not feeling comfortable with myself. Like I, I feel stuffy, you know? So 
I've been trying to eat a little bit healthier and kind of change my eating patterns back to what it used to be. I'm going to try to start working out. Um, he bought me a rowing machine like ages ago and I've only used it like 10 times and so I'm going to be really diligent about using it, going on my walks with Ebby and my husband. Um, I'm just trying to row at least 30 minutes, five days a week. I don't know if that's too much of a reach, but I feel like I can do it. Okay, so this is how it looks right when I take my hair out of the rollers, but now I'm just gonna kind of run my fingers through it like this. So now that I'm done with my hair and makeup, I'm going to water all of our plants. We don't have too many. I think we only have like three, or no, we have, yeah, we have three plants. So I'm going to water them because today is plant watering day. I usually try to do it on the weekend. I've only been watering my plants once a week because it's the winter, but I'm imagining that once it's the spring, I'll have to water them more often because it gets hot here in LA. But I just have some laundry going, which I'm sure you can hear in the background. Um, nothing riveting over here. It's just daily life stuff. Um, we haven't really been going out because Jen has been really, really busy with schoolwork. We're both currently in school right now. I am finishing my program very soon, whereas he just started his program. He's actually getting his MBA, and so we've both been really busy um, just tackling school and work. And um, yeah, so just nothing exciting over here. I just started watching Sweet Magnolias, and I would say it's not good, but it's not bad. Like, it's pretty entertaining, and so I've been watching that. Um, I think I'm on like episode four right now, and I think I'll continue to watch it. So far, it's like pretty cute. I just picked up chicken kebab and beef kebab for dinner tonight. I feel like we haven't had Mediterranean food in a really long time. That was like a really good place uh, close to my parents' house that Jin and I um, really like and my family and I, my family and I have been to quite a few times. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to dig in. I'm gonna head home right now because Jin has class soon and he needs to eat before um, his class, or not his class, his group meeting. So I just dropped off Ebby at my parents' house for the week. Um, we kind of have like a shared custody with Ebby. Um, she spends like one week with my parents, one week with us. And so uh, this week she'll be with my parents for the week. And on top of that, I'll be babysitting one of my best friend's dogs, um, Bailey. I can't wait, he's so cute. My best friend is going to Austin this week and then the week after she comes back i'll be going to austin and so it's like we're taking turns checking out austin and seeing what it's like <laughs> <laughs> 